Greetings everyone. Manu Patra brings to you the news highlights of 13th December 2022. Starting with the Supreme Court. The Supreme Court has held that orders giving visitation rights or temporary child custody cannot be passed in a proceeding under section 9 of the Hindu Marriage Act that is restitution of conjugal rights. The court has granted anticipatory bail to Raj Kundra and other co-accused in the several FIRs arising out of the porn videos case registered by the nodal cyber police station Bandra. The court has allowed the plea filed by Chief Executive Officer of New Okla Industrial Development Authority Ritu Maheshwari IAS challenging Allahabad High Court's orders seeking her personal presence before it and issuing non-bailable warrant against her. The court has held that the accused's plea on applicability of section 300 CRPC has to be considered at the stage of discharge under section 227 CRPC. News highlights from the high courts starting with the Delhi High Court. The Delhi High Court has held that in cases of organ transplant from a near relative, the difference in financial position of the donor and the recipient by itself cannot be a reason strong enough to establish a commercial element. The High Court has directed the Delhi government to ensure compliance of prohibition of Electronic Cigarettes Act 2019 and asked the Delhi police to take steps to ensure that such e-cigarettes are not sold near and around schools and colleges in the national capital. News highlights from the Allahabad High Court. The Allahabad High Court has restrained State Election Commission from announcing urban local body elections notification and asked the state if the triple test mandate to institute OBC quotas in local polls had been carried out by it or not. The High Court has held that the anticipatory bail application of an accused is not maintainable if he is in jail in connection with another criminal case for similar or different offenses. News highlights from other high courts in the country. The Bombay High Court has held that marrying another woman by husband during existence of his first marriage is most likely to cause trauma and grave injury to the mental health of the first wife and would amount to cruelty under section 498A of the IPC unless it has been done with the consent of the first wife. Other news highlights in the country. A Delhi court has granted interim bail to Umar Khalid for a period of 1 week in the larger conspiracy case of 2020 North East Delhi rights to attend his sister's marriage ceremony. This concludes the news for today. Thank you so much.